EastEnders has finally addressed a long-running mystery regarding Jean Slater's health, as she got the answers she needed tonight, September 14. Jean, Gillian Wright, was left fearing that her cancer had returned earlier this year, having discovered a new lump last Christmas. Although Jean initially followed the necessary procedures by heading to the GP, she ultimately decided not to undergo further investigations, opting to accept her fate instead. As a result, Jean has been convinced that Shush has been living with terminal cancer ever since, a belief that was intensified when she collapsed in Tuesday's scenes. Having been arrested on suspicion of a drugs offense, Jean desperately tried to argue her case down at the police station, but grew increasingly distressed when they wouldn't give her an update on her young relative Tommy. Jean's health then took a turn for the worst and she collapsed, resulting in a trip to the hospital. There, Jean was overcome with emotion to learn that she didn't actually have cancer, and never did. The doctor explained that Jean's lump was found to be benign back in January, and that the symptoms Shush has been experiencing have been brought on by stress. Despite her overwhelming news, Jean was quickly brought back down to earth when she had to return to the police station shortly afterwards. With the drugs charge still posing a worrying threat, the police officer informed Jean that she might not be dying, but Shush is still going to prison, and for a very long time. Can Jean prove her innocence? 